Hi traders, short recap of my trading session today. I'm about to trade ISIG. Now notice the fact that ISIG started with a huge gap up over 28%. Now when you have a stock gaping up that much, in fact more than 3%, you expect a gap and go, meaning gap and a continuation. Now the problem is when you have a huge gap up, 28% ISIG, it may be that the profit taking power, which means the power that's going to drive it down from people who are taking their profits is could be bigger than the profit of the grid which usually drive a gap and go higher so I'm planning a short because it just failed to move higher look at the way it failed right over here that's a failure over $29 or so and the second one came later now it's proving to me that it wants to come down so I'm about to short it again the power of profit taking which will drive it down so I'm about to short 4,000 shares a nice technical formation shorting here 4,000 now again the power of profit taking when a stock is gapping up that much is huge sometimes depending on the news depending on the technical behavior you could see a stock like that moving higher but now you have a proof that it's failing so I'm up like uh, two grand right now I'm about to take my partial remember again you take the partial relatively very fast and I'm taking it right over here leaving 400 shares now when you short a stock that is that strong you just don't take any chance I mean the first the, the, the first wave down the first move down be real quick to take your profit don't bet on the fact that it's going to continue coming down it's more like a scalp it's not a, it's not even a day trade it's more like a scalp 400 shares left and I'm about to take the rest of my um, I mean covered another 300 shares over here and left just 100 as you can see here it just moved down under $28 approximately one and a half point so that was a beautiful trade but again don't trust it to continue coming down remember the profit taking will be over at some point and when the profit taking is over the stock would normally find its support and in many many times and that could be another way to trade these kinds of stocks move up so there's several of ways trading stocks that are gapping up over 10 percent let's call it this way anyway you need to, to to make sure that it does gap up with a huge volume this one had uh, uh, quite a bit of volume I can't remember tens of thousands tens of millions of shares or so and anyway it was a beautiful trade and um, here are my results as you can see it's not my only winner today I've got uh, some other great trades in BIAB and Tesla not a lot of trades but three out of three trades and that all happened really in the first 30 minutes over $22,000 now if it seems to you like it's simple it is not it's extremely hard and trading is extremely dangerous anyway if you like this video please give me a thumb up I would really appreciate it and uh, Here's my trade in Tesla as you can see here uh, that's the first time that it came down that's a gap and go short and BIB it's the same idea it's another gap and go short so again if you like this video please give me a thumb up if you want to register to our channel there's a button right here and you can hit on the notification bell to be notified of my future uploads and please remember again trading is extremely hard please be careful most traders lose money and whatever you're seeing here is very untypical my results are normally better than those of novice traders and in fact I'm a very experienced trader so it's very untypical please don't lose more than you can afford to lose there's a demo link right here below to the same platform I'm trading Colmex you can use this link it's a free link to start trading with a demo please start with a demo not with real money Thank you again. I'll see you in the next video.